Yo guys and welcome to episode 12 of the Cardiff City Manager Career Mode on FIFA 22. So yes guys we're back with another video on this series and yeah it should be a pretty good one. Um, there's a lot of action in this one definitely. Um, this one's going to be a weird episode but yes. Um, we have a first game against Coventry City there 19th in the table so. I just thought I would simmer and then you know hopefully it would get a win in it. And the team actually manages to draw so. Yes, yeah, not the best of results. Um, you know, I want to get the series moving a little bit quicker. And if we're just um, simming some of the, you know, teams that are lower on the table, I think that is a good thing. And we should probably do that. Because I don't think you guys would just be... I don't think you guys would want to watch, um, you know, just a full season of every single championship game with Cardiff City. So, um, yeah. So we get off with a... Alright, start here. Wolvox has a shot on goal. Um... Key for more takes a shot and then is not able to go in. And then we have Bolters to Diallo. Diallo had a chance here, saved by the goalkeeper again. Um, apparently, the goalkeeper is an island. I thought it was um, Asmir Begovic, but anyways, Bolters with a shot and Bolters shoots and he actually scores. So, yes, what an amazing goal from him to get a starter off in this game. So, yes, just with a little replay there. Um, brace with a shot and that is a horrific shot. I don't know what his weak foot it is, so um, That is probably on as a weak foot Yeah, it looks like we have a chance here and it never really leads to anything um, Yeah, he tried to take like a volley chance up there, but didn't seem to go in um, Brooks with a shot doesn't go in either um, And then we get out of this one, but they actually give away a penalty um, I'm not sure what the referee was thinking, giving away a penalty. But anyways, um, yeah, we're just gonna have a look at a little replay, and it's just it's just FIFA because I kick the ball, and then for some reason he just decides to tackle the guy. Um, he shoots it down the middle, and then they tie the game, one one. So yes, not not the best results. Anyway, more with a chance. More takes a shot, and I didn't. I don't even know how that how that didn't even go in. Usually, more always takes it and he gets. Any, any scores but anyways we give away a free kick and yes um looks like we have one more chance here Baltus is the ball um he has a couple of guys around him gives it into rails rails um kind of kind of fumbled it and then marlon pack kind of fumbles it um we get off a shot but it's saved by that keeper so yes that is going to be the end of the game and we Worst result, um, obviously could be better, but yes, um, as you can see we've scouted some players as it is now um, in the transfer, you know, window. So, um, yeah, just scouting some more defenders because I feel like we need a um, a good backup defender, let's say, because Nelson and Morrison are obviously always going to start, but if we could have a backup, um, someone that's decently good to come off the bench um, as a defender, um, that would be very good. So anyways, this guy Robinson is pacey with it and he somehow gets past our defender and then he shoots and he's not able to score. So anyways, um, Robinson and Smithies go up together. Um, and Smithies obviously goes down. Baltus with a shot and it is saved by the post. Baltus with a ball, he finds a open player. And more and more take the shot and we are now up one goal to nil in this game. So yes, um, Robert Snodgrass does some skill moves and a save by our keeper. So yes, Diallo with the ball. Uh, Diallo has, finds some open space. He's going to shoot and he actually scores. So yes, um, if we can get some more goals from Diallo, that would obviously be very good for us. Um, more plays it into rail. The rail has some space. Give it to um, Jaden Brace. Um, I've been saying Jordan Brace this whole time, but it's actually Jaden. So. Brace scores and he makes it 3-0 against West Bremer Chalvian at half time. So yes, we're going to make some more substitutions. Um, Rails is obviously a little bit tired, so we're going to bring on Bacana. And yes, we're obviously resting some players because our next game is actually a semi-finals. Um, so yes, that'll be a really big game. So yes, they have a chance here. They have it um, with this guy. He takes a shot and he's able to score. I don't know what the defenders are doing. But he scores and he makes it. He gets some one goal for their team. 
see if they have the ball again they put in across um and yep yeah, that is fifa for you that is fifa at its finest somehow my player wants to tap it and then it just i don't even know what just happened like why like he does a header why can't the keeper just go and get it man it's so frustrating in this game because i don't know fifa scripted so i feel like they want West Bromwich Albion to have a draw or win in this game. And then Thomas Asante had a chance to score. Kind of seal it off, but he just misses it. So that is a pretty bad miss from him. So yes, they have the ball. Um, that was Livermore. They give it to Robinson. Robinson shoots and he scores to tie the game 3-3. Since I feel like the game was scripted for them to draw the game. Um, I don't even know how he managed to score a long shot on the 90th minute to draw the game. Like... How am I meant to even stop that? Like, I don't even get it. And Evenson, Eve, and Robinson actually didn't even have any energy at that point. Um, his stamina was completely gone. Um, so yes, we've signed some more, um, like, prospects or whatever. We have this guy called Stacy Baldwin. Um, he has good potential, so we um, signed him to the senior squad. I don't think he'll get any game time, though. So yes, we have our next game in the semifinals of the... Um, Carabao Cup against Aston Villa. So yeah, this is going to probably be the hardest team we've worth in this episode. Obviously, they have um, Martinez, um, Watkins. So yeah, um, be a pretty big game. And obviously, um, Leon Bailey. So yes, hopefully we're able to get this win and um, go into the finals and win the whole Carabao Cup. Since we have an early opportunity and Moore's able to score, so that is a very good goal from him. And gets us up one goal to nil in this game. Then we have Volks into Rails. Rails is a boy. Pro could have done a three ball. But that is a good save by Martinez. Rails takes a shot. And then yep. They, they, they give us a penalty. I mean. I don't know if that should have been a penalty. But you know what. I'm just going to take it. Like, so, so yes. Um, he did a slide tackle. And kind of clipped him I guess. Uh, that is not a penalty. But I'm going to try and score it anyways. Um, I try and go. L left top corner, we take the shot and then we score with bolters. So, yes, that is a very good goal for us. And obviously, 2, two nil up against Aston Villa is a pretty good start to the game, obviously. So, look at another shot. So, yes, we have the ball again with Will Vox, and he gets absolutely taken out by um, House, I think that is his name. Um, I think he has a good card in like FIFA and stuff. Um, Rails with the ball, he takes a shot, and that is a good save by Martinez. We have a corner here, and then Martinez will try to dive and save it, but that was definitely not going into the goals. Um, so we try to take another shot, and good save by him. That the ball with Bailey, they put into McGinn, and that's a good save by Smithy. Since we found some space with Bolt, that is a very good turn. He's going to shoot, and he's actually going to score, so that is an amazing um, play from him. To get us up three goals to nil against Aston Villa. And this is exactly what happened in the last game as well. So um, hopefully it won't be a um, case of some deja vu. But anyways, they take a shot and it does not go in. So yes, more with the ball. He plays an amazing through ball to Diallo. Diallo has a ball. Um, he passes it off to Bolters. Bolters shoots and then saved by Martinez. So probably could have shot that a lot better. So yes, they bring on Danny Yang, they substituted Ollie Watkins off, and then Smithy's like, I don't even know what he's doing. He just didn't even bother to try and save it, so. Um, yeah, just doing some substitutions now, because um, our next game, we're versing Arsenal, and I think, um, I'm not sure exactly what it is, but it's a round of 16 of some sort of cup, so. Yes, we want to try and rest our players for them, and we're up four goals to nil, so we're able to do that. See if the um, this Will Volk shoots and yeah he gets it in and makes it 4-1 in this game. Then we clear the ball away and we have won this game. See so if with this game over we are now going to do player of the video.
So guys, as you can see, um, our next game is obviously against Arsenal, and apparently there's been an offer for James Collins. Um, if you guys think I should sell him, let me know. Um, he's not really playing, so I think I probably shouldn't get some more money if I want to make a transfer for a different person. But yeah, that's going to be the end of the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you could leave a like and subscribe, that would be greatly appreciated. And yeah, I'll be back with another video of the Carter City um, Manager Career Mode. And yes, I'll just let it um, play out for you guys. It's a mosh pit. Yeah, shout it bad, but she broke and she don't own shit. Mama asked me, son, when the trap and gone quit. I've been riding round through the city in my new bitch. Yo, nigga, pop it with a pocket full of cottage. Hey, whoa, chemo, sob it, chop up, aim it, get your noggin. Hey, had to cut the body in the top, I had to chop it. Nigga,